Talk. We've been warning you every few weeks about new skimmers as they pop up at Austin area gas stations. Well, now there's a new tool on the market that can also help in the fight. KXAN's Jacqueline Powell got an exclusive look. It's just a matter of turning it on. This small machine. And it will take about 30 seconds to a minute to do an initial scan of the area. Could make a huge difference. That's a known skimming address. When it comes to catching skimmers on gas pumps. Rather than taking apart the entire dispenser to get in and, and look for a skimmer, this allows the service company or the regulatory agency to just basically do a quick scan. It's called a blue sleuth. Texas Ag Commissioner Sid Miller got a demonstration. This is the first one that I've actually visually seen myself. He's considering buying the pricey tools at around $1,000 each. It just went tilt. For his inspectors. <laughs> if it'll protect the consumer, we'll figure out how to pay for that. States like California and Nevada and even the Department of Defense are already using them. That's a good signal. It's the latest in Miller's campaign to spread the word and stop thieves who plant skimmers. I think we've made a difference. Uh, People are reporting them now. He says crime rings installed the machines first in East Texas around Tyler. Then, as people began reporting them, we cracked down on them because they moved. Then they moved to Katy. They, they, then they hit Austin. And so the more, the harder we are on them, they pick up and move. He says by drawing attention to a number of skimmers popping up in North Austin lately, we kind of run them out of here now. You're not seeing as many in this, this part of town. But Miller says he's looking into this tool because there's no telling where they'll pop up next. Technology gets better, the crooks get better, and then we have to stay one step ahead of them. Jacqueline Powell, KXAN News. In the past year, 20 skimmers found in the Austin metro area. 476 possible skimmers are reported in the Austin, Austin metro area since the start of 2017, and that's way more than any other part of the state. So people are really paying attention here. We wanted to know how often people behind these skimmers are prosecuted. We talked with the Travis County Sheriff's Office and we were told that they haven't filed any cases dealing with skimmers in months. The Department of Agriculture says in the past year, Texas has seen a 30% drop in skimmer cases.